I was recently asked to explain how I put on and wear my headgear for my ottoman outfits. So I thought I'd make a short video to um, show you guys how I do it and um, hopefully answer any questions you might have. I start with a kerchief. This is a piece of linen um, that was just cut down and folded in half. I secure it with one of these uh, round penannulars. Um, and I usually leave it secured. I got it to where it fits my head perfectly and it just stays like that. So this is the first thing that goes on for me. As you can see, it's nice and tight. Uh, you can see I had a hard time getting it on, um, but it is it is pretty pretty secure once you get it on and once you get it to the tightness that you want. Um, the next step for me is typically um, my face veil. Uh, this is this is silk gauze. This one in particular is crinkle gauze um, that I believe came from ThaiSilks.com. Um, but I use a lot of the gauze from dharmatrading.com. Um, it's not got the crinkle to it. And I like it a lot better. So I have a box full of veil pins here. Most of these are corsage pins that I've taken and dipped the end in enamel paint to give it some color. Um, and they're cheap and easy to make and I go through them fairly quickly. Um, so that's how I keep, that's how I keep my stash up. And I'll take and pin, do one pin in the back to the kerchief. And then I secure it on either side with two more pins. The next step for me is going to be my hat. And I take what is uh, left over from the kerchief, the part that folds down in the back, and stuff it under there. And it, it kind of makes it a little more secure, um, but you don't have to do that. Um, and then just pin your hat to your kerchief without pinning it to your head. Um, this hat in particular is made with the plastic canvas um, that you can get in um, like the kids needle felting sections or needle crafting sections at most craft stores um, and it makes a pretty decent base it's hard to pin to uh, so which is why I go through pins so quickly um, but you can also use like buckram or stiffened canvas or um, uh, interfacing that you can get at most craft stores to uh, form the base to your hat. All right, so my hat's on, my face veil is on. Um, and then the next part I do is a. I, I don't want to call it a turban. It's it's more of a head wrap. A turban is a very specific type of wrap. Um, this is silk. Uh, that it's the same kind of silk that I used to make silk banners. And you can tie it in the front or you can tie it in the back. It just depends on your preference. So I take and twist it. Wrap it around. And pin it to the kerchief. I use the pins to hold the twist in place and to hold the twist to um, the kerchief so it doesn't separate like you see here it kind of separates throughout and and if you're not careful it'll do that throughout the day and um, that's why you that's why you pin it into place uh, 
Uh, I usually use a lot more pins than that. Uh, to hold all day, I use anywhere from 20 to 35 pins to keep everything in place. Um, this is the point where I would put on my wreath, but it's not in the box, so I'm not going to do that. Um, this is also the point where if you have any bobbles or uh, head bling, you can put it on now. So I'll put this on. Uh, after this, I do my outer veil. <clears throat> and I typically take and pin the top of the outer veil in two spots. Some people put it in one. You can just do a pin that goes straight across. Um, but I find it holds better if I do two pins that go down the side of the hat. And then I take another pin here. Another pin here. Um, I'm going to make sure these are about even. And then add your feathers. And you can either... You do one of two things. I typically just take my feathers and stick them in the head wrap. You can also um, get boutonniere um, or corsage pins that are, um, oh, let me see if I have one, that hold um, like this, that will hold feathers and you can pin these to your hat and you can put decorative things on the front of them. Um, I typically just take and, and put it in there because usually I'm running late and in a hurry. And that's it. That's how I do my head wraps. If you guys have any questions, um, feel free to tag me on Facebook as Jack Cordray or um, message me here or on the Ottoman Facebook group. Um, good luck!